Hits the top of centre half forward. Big fist in there by Max Gorn. He might get the handball received here. He's got numbers around him. He's got it back. Big Maxi Gorn. He goes long, Max Gorn. And he's kicked it. What's going on, Godzilla Nation? This is our Godzilla. We are back with some more AFL Evolution Fantasy Draft Series. Thank you for joining me, as always, this week. Round four, Sydney Swans, first place third, both 78 rated. Some of you at home might have been following this series going, but Godzilla, wasn't your team a 79 overall? Well, in the last episode, Dusty got injured, managed to escape injury. Jaeger O'Meara got reported, and he has been whacked with a two-match ban that we cannot, for whatever reason, contest. I was hoping to be able to contest it. We can't. So Jaeger O'Meara out. Sam Menegola coming in on the wing to take his spot. And on the bench, we have Jack Graham slotting in. To fill the void considering Menegola's come off the bench to play. Quickly move down to show you the live ladder as it stands heading into this game. Richmond and Geelong both undefeated up the top. Sydney Swans sitting in third. Port Adelaide rounding out the top four. With Melbourne, the Gold Coast Suns, North Melbourne and Collingwood rounding out the top eight. Carlton tied for what is pretty much equal third spot. Only out of the top eight by percentage. Doing a lot better than what the real-life Carlton Blues are doing, let me tell you what. But without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to dive into this match. The captain for the Sydney Swans is none other than Josh Kennedy from the Eagles. This is going to be a good contest. Sydney Swans have Gary Ablett himself in the middle, but does not have much way of support being the fact that he is a 91 rated overall player and then the next best rated midfielder they have is a 76 in Ryan Lester. So that is where the ball can be won for us if we can get hands on it early in the middle. A midfield group has been going to work in this series. At the start when I drafted it, we knew the combination of Max Gorn, Dustin Martin, Clayton Oliver, Tom Mitchell. Absolutely unstoppable. If you put those four players in a real-life situation, that is an absolutely dominant midfield group. Richmond v Sydney, MCG, packed house. First v third. There's our team. Looking as good as always. Jack Graham comes in and gets his chance. And there we go, the Sydney lineup. As I mentioned, they've got Gary Ablett. They've got Cade Simpson, Shea, uh, Sean Higgins, Brad Shepard. They've got Nysmith in the ruck. They've got Jake Lever. They've got Hibbard. So they've got some really good players, Sydney. And they've drafted both Collard Dajny boys, which I find actually quite entertaining because obviously for a CPU to draft, they go off of the best available rating at the time. It just happened that both the brothers were available come Sydney selection and got drafted to the same team. Here come your beloved Tigers. Luke Bruce, the last one to come out of the rooms. Dustin Martin, the captain. Heaney at the back there. I'm looking forward to continuing not only this draft series, but getting some under other things. I said under things. But I meant other things underway. Already got plans for when AFL Evolution 2 drops later on in the year, so stay tuned for that. I'm also keen on potentially sitting back and making our own collective team and putting them through a season where some of you guys might be able to nominate a player that you think we should pick up, and we'll just do like a God's Zero Nation team where the comment section, vote on the players we take, and we see how well that team performs. But let's get focused on this match at hand. Matty Nichols balls it up. Sam Nysmith wins it for Sydney. Sydney going to get it in by hand. Chipping ball up forward. Cade Simpson is going to have to kick it from about 55. He's given it a good look, but it's to the far side. Sydney open up their first score with a behind. Oscar McDonald plays on, moves the ball on long. 
Good bounce there for Mitchell. He takes it inside forward 50. He's got a couple there. Off hands by Caddy. Sydney send it straight back up the line, but only as far as Tom Mitchell again. Back inside 50. Good body work by Kerno. Diving mark by Josh Caddy. He's looking to pass it off here. He goes in the Bruce direction and he's hit him lace out on the chest. We know one commentator that's going to get excited if he slots this. Oh, he's special. Luke Bruce. First goal kicker of the game. Bruce McAvaney. He's getting excited. One goal straight plays one behind. Caddy gets the handball back off to Gorn. Dustin Martin's there. Kick off the deck by Clayton Oliver. Richmond still have the numbers around the ball here. Sydney are going to work it out by hand. That's a high tackle against Richmond. Sydney can slow down. Sam Nysmith takes it half back. Chips it up forward. Finds Aaron Mullet. Who in turn finds Ryan Lester. We were just knocking these midfielders and they're taking easy marks in front of us. Sean Higgins has it just inside 50. Moves it to the top of the square. And he has found Cade Simpson. Has he learnt from his mistakes? You better believe he has. He has put Sydney on the board with a major. But more importantly, Sydney now in front by a point. One goal straight six plays 1-1-7. One, one, Sydney's way early term. No prior opportunity. Ball up. Bourne gets it down. Sydney throwing the handball around. But Richmond trying to put a stamp to it. Get tackled. Gorn starting to dominate the hit-out contest. Caddy gets hip and shoulder, and I don't know what he was standing around for. Dusty's got it. Nice handball. Turns it over, however, to Sydney. Good handball there to Mitchell. Mitchell goes in long. Kerno takes it out in front. He's got a good set of hands, Charlie Kerno. And he's got a good kick as well. Puts it through the middle. Richmond have their second. They're back in front. Two straight 12 plays 1 1 7 Richmond by five points. Caddy gets tackled. That's going to be holding the ball. Adam Saad should be happy. Ha! Sam Doherty takes it to half back, moves the ball forward. Josh Caddy goes for a body check and misses. Chipping ball out to Josh Kennedy, who seems to be in the ruck now. Okay, odd choice. Gary Ablett takes a diving mark just shy of half forward for Sydney. Pops it inside 50. Sean Higgins. It's a kick from about 45. He's pushed it to the right. Two goal straight plays, 1-2-8. Call me Dr. Seuss. The body work there by Mitchell wasn't good enough. Dane Beams takes it. He finds Gary Ablett. Chipping ball inside 50. Sam Doherty manages to find a way through the gap and takes a clean mark. Josh Kennedy, however, then turns it over. It's a game of kick to kick at the moment. Ryan Schoenmakers now has it for a potential shot on goal. And he's nailed it. Sydney back in front. Two goals straight, 12 plays, 2-2-14. Two, two, Sydney leading by two points, dying moments of the final quarter. I don't think there's time enough to score here. But we can try. That's going to be a free kick against Josh Caddy. And a 50 metre penalty. But that's the first quarter done and dusted. Sydney leading Richmond by two points. We knew coming into this game it was going to be a tight contest. They have pushed us to the limit in that opening quarter. Tom Mitchell most on the field with four touches. Nysmith, Lester and Higgins both with three. Two goal kickers per team. Great opening quarter. Good hard contest. That's what we're after, ladies and gentlemen. Max Gorn wins it. Tap straight down to Gary Ablett. Dustin Martin's there. Good tackle. Should have been holding the ball. Tom Mitchell gets in as well. A good tackle there by Sicily. Handball off. Dustin Martin finds his man again. Gorn waits. Goes back to Dusty. He goes long. And misses. Pretty good roost considering the location he was at. 
Oh, chipping ball in and Bruce. Luke Bruce, he's looking for his second. And he's kicked it. Calm down, Bruce. Calm down. Luke Bruce with two. Richmond back up by five. Dusty's there. He finds a break. He goes from 50. Is that going to sneak in? He's hit the post. That would have lifted the roofless roof off of the MCG had he had slot that one, ladies and gentlemen. It's now a leg race. Jordan to go. He's going to miss it. That's a big roost. That's bounced almost center wing. Got to play a loose at the back. He's got him. Ball spills the opposite direction. Gary Ablett finds a man. Brad Shepard. Looks to take it inside 50. Tom Phillips. Who's going to pass it? Find Sean Higgins. To bring it back to a tied ball game. And that's exactly what he has done. Game on at the MCG. 3-2 plays 3-2. Big hip and shoulder there. Dustin Martin with a good tackle. Another big hip and shoulder. Handball off. Menegola. Oh, God. That's probably why he's been sitting on the bench all season. Petrarca, however, to turn it into a seven-point play, makes 100% sure of it. That is two quick goals from turnover kick-ins. Seven points Richmond's way. 4-3, 27-3-2-20. Josh Caddy taken with it. Didn't have prior. Got to get Dustin Martin injected into this game. Good tackle there by Dusty. No prior opportunity. Naismith coming off for Kennedy. Kennedy in the ruck. That's a... That is an odd choice. Richmond looking for a quick break, but Sydney's tackling pressure around the contest is phenomenal. Heaney's got it. Around the body. Bruce is deep. Jake Lever's going to take it uncontested. Moves it out. Good body work by Brayshaw, but he pushes McDonald Tip and Woody onto the ball. Good mark there by Max Gorn. He's going to look to take it back into the forward 50. Petrarca's out loose. He's potentially going to look for a quick pass off here. Come on, Kerno, come at me. And that's what the big man does. Make sure of it. You got to make sure of those when you get pinpoint precision like that. He's got his second, the big man. Richmond out to a 13 point lead. 5 3 33, 3 2 20. Sydney inside 50. Tom Phillips well within striking range to bring it back to seven points and he makes sure of it getting it just over the head of Oscar McDonald I don't know why he didn't try to throw a fist in there Gorn getting a late contest but still managing to win it Richmond had plenty of numbers around the ball but Sydney have worked this out brilliantly that's too high and he's going to get put to the sword because you don't give Dustin Martin that much room Max Gorn to Dusty Oh, damn, he didn't have enough time to get the kick. Neither did Gorn. Chipping ball to half-back finds Aaron Mullet. He's just going to chip it over to Josh Kennedy. Good hands there by Cade Goladajny. He moves it out. Finds Ryan Schoenmakers. Hits the top of centre-half forward. Big fist in there by Max Gorn. He might get the handball receive here. He's got numbers around him. He's got a back big Maxi Gorn. He goes long, Max Gorn, and he's kicked it. Max Gorn from 50, if you don't mind. Big moment. Back to 13 points. 6 3 39, 4 2 26. That's your half time score line. Right when we needed a bit of a buffer, Max Gorn stands up tall. 10 effective disposals that quarter, if you don't mind. Clayton Oliver. Max Gorn, Dustin Martin, all with five. Aaron Mullett and Josh Kennedy leading the way for Sydney with six. The only multiple goal kickers so far, Charlie Curnow and Luke Bruce. We've got a contest, ladies and gentlemen.
It's still 13 points, but they're pushing us to our limit. Expecting a big second half here. Max Gorn, Sam Nysmith in the middle. Tackles left, right and centre. Get him, Dusty. Sydney well and truly open. Chipping ball inside 50. Misses the target. Zach to his air. Oh, he could have been pinned for deliberate. Gets away with one, I think. We've got to throw up just shy of the 50 metre line. Sydney's forward half. Good kick off the deck there to clear some space. Sydney's got the ball, however. They move it to the goal line. It bounces past Tom... Oh! Tommy Stewart's not going to be happy about that. Shawnee Higgins brings it back to seven points. I thought Tom Stewart was going to get a hand on that ball, but I was wrong. Good tackle there by Dustin Martin. Kick off the deck, keeps the ball live. There are more Richmond numbers around this ball than Sydney, but they're maintaining possession really well. That's a push in the back. Take the ball, Dusty. Trying to set Dusty up with a long bomb. We're doing the right thing. We just can't find the man. Off the deck. Good tackle by Caddy. Someone stood up here. Oh, it's a behind. It was Tom Mitchell. Splitting the pack. Coming through hard. Managing to just miss at the last minute. Diving mark there by Jake Kolodajny. Playing opposite sides of the ground. Adam Saad has it for Sydney. Finds Jake. Moves it out to the wing. Good body work there by Richmond. It's going to be a throw in. Centre wing. Good contest. I'm loving this contest. Good tap down. Dustin Martin's got it. He gets hip and shoulder. Max Gorn's going to get the handball out. Oh, you can't pin him deliberate, umpire. I handballed it the wrong way. Gary Ablett has it. The ball's inside to be won. Sydney's there. Oh, throw in the ball. Thank God, I thought that was a high tackle. Just about to say I'm getting robbed. Aaron Mullet takes a pack mark. Moves it up inside 50. Hits Tom Phillips on the chest. Chipping ball. Turned over Zach Tui. Gets the handball off. Goes long on the wing. Dustin Martin's there. Going to be taken by Tom Mitchell. Tom Mitchell chips it. Dusty takes it out in front. He's going to move the ball inside 50. He's got a couple of Tigers there. Bruce! Oh, Bruce lining up for his third. Someone get the Kleenex up to the commentary room because Bruce McEvane, he is going insane. Bruce has kicked his third. Dare I say, his gameplay today has been delicious. Dustin Martin from 50. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, Dusty from 50. Speaking of delicious, oh. Richmond down to a game high, 20 point lead, 8 4 52, 5 2 32. Dusty's got it again. He goes for a run, he chips it inside to Caddy. They're having a field day, Richmond. This is turning into a drill. Kerno's there. Kerno's looking for something. He's going to go the buoy, nah, nah. Nah, 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 he missed. He's done it again. Christian Petrarca from the kick in. Looking to pass it off to Kerno. Did the good ring work there on the full back. And he is going back, ladies and gentlemen. And he's made sure of his third. He'd have to be leading the Coleman race. Gorn wins the tap down to Caddy. Caddy gets the handball off. Free kick to Richmond. What's Caddy looking to do in here? Going in long in the Petrarca direction. Turned over Fletcher Roberts. Goes long out to the wing. He's found McDonald tipping Woody. Gary Ablett. Knew that was coming. Inside to Ryan Lester. Top of the 50. Turned over Sam Doherty. Playing a good game in defense for Richmond. Goes in bounds. It's going to come out. I was very weary of that play. Big hip and shoulder. That's three quarter time. Richmond go in with a 27 point lead. And in the grand scheme of things. Richmond have pretty much locked up this game. 
in what was a very tight contest for a half. Richmond putting their foot down in what's known as the Premiership Quarter. 18 effective disposals. When was the last time, or when was ever you saw that stat? Gorn, Martin and Caddy with eight. Mullet has had nine. Kerno and Bruce, three each. Sean Higgins, two for the Sydney Swans. Huge quarter coming up. We've seen very weird things happen in this series so far. Sydney could come from out of nowhere, go whack whack early, and all of a sudden we're staring at a close ball game again. What we need to do here is put the foot down and make sure we put Sydney away. Dustin Martin, we need to get off the chain this quarter. We need to get it into the hands of Dustin Martin. Let's put the game away. Let's get Dusty three votes. Ball up by Nichols. Tapped down by Gorn. Good tackle there. Sydney, however, fast break. Inside 50. Higgins has it. I told you. He's going to move it laterally. He's found Cade Kolodajny, who will line up for his shot. And he split the middle. Makes no doubt about it. Sydney bring it back to 21 points. 9-5, 59, 6 2, 38. Caddy taps it on. Oh, good tackle there. Should have been holding the ball, I feel. Plenty of Richmond numbers around the ball. Sydney get it out. Good turn over there. Tom Mitchell has it. Center wing gets around one. Inside 50. Off hands. Caddy's there. Chipping ball. Hits the heart of Michael Hartley. How do you like that? The heart of Michael Hartley. <laughs> Taken by Sam Naismith. Tom Mitchell again cutting it off. Back inside. Off hands again. Dusty's there. He popped up down to nowhere, Dustin Martin. He's like a jack-in-the-box. They finally managed to work it out from that little kick there. Fletcher Roberts moves it across the ground. Adam Saad taking a diving grab. Jordan degoe has got it. He's going to chip it in to Bruce. He's turned it over to Jake Lever. I don't know how he managed to mark that from behind. But anyway, Dusty's got it. He's going to take the man on. He's going to hit the top of the square. Good play. Hartley, with the bodywork, manages to get Kerno out of the way. And finds Jake Kolodajny on the chest at half back. Moves it out, finds Aaron Mullet. That was not 15 metres, umpire, but he's going to pay it anyway. Nysmith moves it on. Off hands. Plenty of Richmond numbers. Dusty's got it. He's going for a run, Dusty. He's going to kick it to the top of the square again. Where's the Richmond numbers? Where's the forward attack? Josh Caddy has been injured for Richmond. No, oh, no, oh, no. Dusty's there. Sydney managed to move the ball along the wing. Back in the guts. Plenty of Richmond numbers around the ball. Taranto's come on for Caddy. Good handball there. Dusty's there. Gets the handball off. Sydney gets the ball. Good cut off there by Isaac Heaney. Takes the man on. Deep inside to Charlie Kerno. Michael Hartley again having a big last term. Cam Pedersen. Out to McDonald tipping Woody. Sydney starting to surge. Naismith has it. Chips it on to Ablett. If there any chance, he needs to hit a target inside 50. He has. He's found Higgins. He needs to kick this. And he's missed. I think that's Sydney's chances all but done. Big kick in from McDonald. Saad's got it. Shipping ball inside. Diving mark by Jake Lloyd. Just moves it down the line. Dusty gets a cheap possession right at the end there. And Richmond come away with four in a row. Tested early. 
but in the end coming away with a huge win. However, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to bring this episode of AFL Evolution Fantasy Series to a close. Thank you for joining me as always. I hope you guys have been enjoying this little series we're doing. If you have been, go ahead and leave a like on the video. It goes a long way to supporting myself. I seriously cannot thank you guys enough for all that support. Recently hit 700 subscribers. We wouldn't have done that without your help. I seriously cannot thank you guys enough. I seriously, seriously cannot. Thank you all. If you're new to the channel, plenty of other content to check out. I urge you to do so. If you enjoy what I'm throwing down, you can get on board the God Zero Nation by hitting that subscribe button. Dustin Martin went huge. He finished with 12. He's surely best on ground here. Dusty best on ground. Sean Higgins second. Tom Mitchell third. I'm happy with that outcome. Social media links are down below. You can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, all that good stuff. As I said, thinking of doing some different things with both AFL Evolution and AFL Evolution 2 when it comes out. So if you want to get notified every single time something like that goes down, hit that notification bell. And not only will you get notified whenever AFL stuff goes down, but all other stuff as well. But that's it from me, guys. I'm out of here. And as always, I will catch you guys next time.